Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. At the range now on a cold and windy day. Winds are 50 miles an hour right here, but is that gonna stop me from making a shotgun video? Nope. And here we have a TriStar Viper G2. Check out that blue receiver. They make the same exact model with a red receiver, but this one here is blue. Now I already floated this out there in the series, one handgun, one shotgun, and one rifle, but now I wanna do it again. I wanna talk about it again, take a few shots and check it out. Couple things about this shotgun. It does have a polymer stock and forend that is rubber molded. So it actually feels like a strong rubber and it has a nice feel on the cheek there. It does have a recoil pad there, a skeletonized recoil pad. Very nice trigger, cross bolt safety that is engaged because the shotgun is loaded. It's a semi-automatic that will accept three inch loads. I've got two and three quarter inch loads right now with a modified choke. Now this is a 30 inch barrel, vet ribbed barrel that is chrome lined. The chamber is chrome lined as well. But check out that barrel made for sporting with a fiber optic front sight and these chokes are Benelli Beretta chokes. So if you have those, you can use those with that shotgun. Although TriStar does give you a total of four chokes. So I do appreciate that. I already mentioned five shells in the magazine tube. It does come with a spacer in there. You just take out this little plug and remove that and you're good to go. But I do have those loads in here now, about oh, 10 yards away from those plates with a modified choke. Uh, seven and a half shot, high velocity bird loads made by Fioca. Wow! And the bolt locks open after the last shot. It's a nice shotgun. I like it. Well, we can see that it is unloaded there. I'm going to remove this choke, the modified choke. I like the modified choke. Uh, shoot slugs with a modified choke all day long. And it's a, uh, it's a good all around choke, the modified. That, that's actually my favorite. But I'm gonna put in here now a full choke. All right, now full means it chokes the pattern. All right, that's what it means. It chokes the pattern, it keeps a tighter pattern and you see those milk jugs over there? I'm gonna give myself the best chance to destroy these. I'll go ahead and put one. There's the uh, bolt release right there. And this is number four uh, Remington Express bird loads. Every time I do a shotgun review, people say, well, let me go ahead and engage the safety. People say, well, why didn't you use this load? You should have used this load. I can only use what I have to use. Because I do a lot of shotgun reviews. I try to. And I don't have everything at all times. I don't work at a gun store. I don't have access to every single type of ammo or every single type of firearm. But right now, I have access to this TriStar Viper G2 with a 30 inch barrel. And I, now we're about, I'd say 14 yards away from those. Actually, let's move up just a little bit because I want to get a reaction. I like a reaction with milk jugs. So let's see if this full choke with this Remington four shot will do that. Let's start at the bottom with that, I got what I wanted. Wow. And whoa, hang on here. All right, now the bull locked back. I, I had six rounds in there and five milk jugs. But I really think this shotgun performs nice. The loading gate is smooth as can be. Let me go ahead and drop that. It's as smooth as can be when loading the shotgun and I do have my truck angled off here to cut off on some of the wind and let me go ahead and do a well that's a choke I can't load that now can I 
I'll take some shots and you can check it out from this perspective. Wow. And there we go. Now a couple weeks ago I showed you the TriStar Cobra 3 marine model. That had an 18 and a half inch barrel. This has a 30 inch barrel with a blue receiver. Very nice. I like the red one too. But it's a nice shotgun. It performs very nice. Not too hard on the shoulder for a gas operated semi-auto shotgun. And I have to say, with the rubber molded stock, it feels really comfortable. And I like this. And if you're into sports and competition, a 30 inch barrel, chrome lined, this would be a pretty good choice. And I have to say, I sure did have fun with this review. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.